Family flower arrangements now because of MDMA. <laughs> Um, one of the things that you talked about was the different chapters okay, of yeah. the mushroom trip. It was just fun to hear you name them because I've had those same chapters okay. in my experiences. Yeah. If that's like a universal experience in mushroom space, which you had named like that spending time with the people that you yeah, love. Yeah, the love inventory is what I call that one. As you were describing that, I was seeing a journey that I had and doing exactly that and seeing you holding the chickens. Okay. As you were describing the love inventory, okay. having a revisioning yes. of loving you, holding chickens and just seeing the archetype of who you are and like the essence of who you are and then just loving you so much in it. If there are mushroom phases, what did you call them? Chapters. Chapters, yeah. what are those chapters? The first one is usually what I call like squeezing through the tight space. Mm. I think of it as like having to like just smash yourself through this really tight like small hole <laughs> and Being it, for a while it feels like mm, kind of like a little nauseous and this is specifically with mushrooms a little bit like ooh, just kind of and once you squeeze through there and it's like whew, okay here I am that one sometimes my last trip was like that was super mild um, I've learned to always be laying down to begin with the love inventory. The questioning. Yeah, the like, oh shoot. Yeah, well, because, you know, like the no turning back. Kind of like, well, I, I ate them and... I can't change it now. Yeah. <laughs> Somebody told me recently that they were describing it like floating the river. If you're gonna float the river, you just, you just float. Yeah, once you're down river, you, you gotta go to the end. Yeah, you can't choose <laughs> yeah. to go back to your car if you don't want to do it. Yeah, you just have you're to in it. for the whole day until you get down to where you need until you're done yeah mm -hmm. there's always a specific moment i think it generally goes squeeze through the tight space and then kind of go into like the liminal headspace of like seeing weird connections and like sort of just feeling into the interconnectedness of my life and someone else's life and these things and this idea and kind of probably whatever it is that I've been thinking about lately. The processing. Yeah, and then at some point after that, then I just want to like be by somebody. Mm. Um, pretty much every time. On the last one, I just started like slowly moving closer and closer to the guy that was laying next to me. <laughs> and Because uh, he was like faced away from me and I was like, even if he doesn't know, <laughs> It doesn't matter. I want to be a little closer just to to him. He's great, you know? <laughs> I feel so heavy and so, like, my body weighs double the density that it normally does to the point where I labor, emotionally labor, getting up to go to the bathroom. I mean, there's that time, yeah, that's a chapter two. <laughs> that's a chapter. That's a chapter. <laughs> Needing to go to the bathroom is a whole yeah, chapter. Well, I gotta go do something right now. Like, if I hadn't gone to the bathroom before, I might not believe that it's possible. Mm -hmm. <laughs> One time I was in the bathroom, going to the bathroom, and I was like, wow, maybe we make like a whole elaborate room just to be in? <laughs> you know, like, okay. <laughs> so it's crazy. What a lot of work just for somewhere to be. <laughs> the other one that stands out to me that I always have is a moment of this is crazy yeah. that my brain can <laughs> do this this is just a little mushroom yeah. how wild of an experience is this right now and yeah. then also feeling really convicted that everybody needs this so badly <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> which is probably why I'm here doing sure. this yeah it's easy to be very optimistic especially after that first experience like it's gonna be fine everyone's gonna do mushrooms it's gonna be great, and we're gonna <laughs> we're gonna figure it out. People have always been doing mushrooms. Yeah, I think for me it's the gratitude of realizing how deeply it's nourishing me in that space, 
and then deeply wanting that same nourishment for society yeah as a whole if we could all just feel this at peace or this loved like that always feels like kind of a come down chapter for me okay just gratitude yeah. yeah that the down slope is always such such a deeply relaxed place it doesn't matter how tumultuous the experience before has been i feel like that that's that let smooth landing is always just like just so peaceful and like i said i rode that feeling out after my first trip for months <laughs>